गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स लेट्स स्टार्ट टू डेज क्लास टूडे वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट न्यू लेसन एंड द लेसन इज हियर चैप्टर थ्री द मूमेंट्स ऑफ द अर्थ यस स्टूडेंट द मूमेंट्स ऑफ द अर्थ इन दिस लेसन वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट द डिफरेंट मूमेंट ऑफ द अर्थ and its effect what are the effects of the movement of the earth so let's start dear student there was a time when the earth was considered to be the center of the universe and the sun and the other planets were thought to be moving around it yes student when we don't have knowledge that was the time in earlier time we know that earth is the center of sun and other planets but now we now know that the sun is at the center of the solar system we now know the sun is at the center of the solar system and the planets including earth revolve around the sun in a definite path called orbit yes student we know we now know that the sun is at the center of the solar system and all planets including earth all planets including earth revolve around the sun in a definite path called orbit the center body is sun and all the planets including earth moves around the sun in a definite orbit in a particular orbit that is called particular path that is called orbit so the earth also rotates on its axis continuously and my dear student earth also rotates on its axis continuously earth rotates around the sun but earth also rotates on its axis just for example you take a globe and spin it in a direction it spin a, on a axis that is called rotation of the earth so na- our next topic will be rotation the movement of the earth on its axis is called rotation the movement of the earth on its axis is called rotation just for example i am standing here and i move all around by change without changing the place i move all around it is called rotation the earth rotates from west to east the earth rotates from west to east it is the direction of earth rotation the earth takes about 24 hours or one day to complete one rotation one rotation of the earth complete in 24 hours it takes 24 hour and the our next topic is the effects of rotation my dear student we know about the rotation what is rotation i think all you understand what is rotation and we will see in this topic what are the effects of rotation so first effect of rotation is the rotation causes day and night rotation causes day and night how you can see here here is a ball and this ball this ball face this is the front portion of the ball and this portion face the light so this portion in this portion there will be day time and the portion which is back here will be night time 
in the same way when earth rotates this side that was the back side but now it is in in front and which is in front that is in back so now on this reason on this side there will be day time and this side there will be night time so rotation of the earth the effect of rotation is causes day and night and for this i have draw a diagram for you you can see here here, here is the sun and here is our earth my dear student this is our earth and when sunlight fall on the earth only one side of the earth face light the side which face the sunlight there will be day time and the face the another face which doesn't get the sunlight there will be night time this is the half portion the lining portion will be will be night and the front portion there will be day time so second is two sides of our planet face the sun and go away from it alternately two sides of our planet face the sun two sides as i told you this side this is the first side and this is the second time but in next time when earth rotates it will be the first time and it will be the second portion it will be the second second part and it will be the first part. so two sides of our planet face the sun and go away from it alternately next is other movement of the earth is revolution revolution what is revolution yes student the earth moves around the sun in a fixed path the earth moves around the sun in a fixed path called orbit as i discussed already here the earth moves around the sun in a fixed path called orbit this movement is called revolution yes student just for example just suppose it is the sun and nine planet sorry eight planet moves around the sun this in this definite path that is called orbit so the earth moves around the sun in a fixed path called orbit this movement is called revolution this movement of the earth is called revolution and the earth takes 364 and a half days how many days 3 and a 365 and a half one fourth day to complete one revolution means the rotation of earth the earth root completes its, its rotation in 24 hour but when we talk about revolution it takes 365 and fourth one fourth day in one revolution and one revolution around the sun we observe our calendar year of 365 days but we observe our calendar year only 365 days so this one fourth portion added each and every year each and every year one fourth day means 6 hour 6 hour added and the one fourth remaining days that is one fourth remaining day is added to added as a an extreme an extra day after every 4 years hai na means after every 4 year this 1 4 portion includes and make a day so 
after four year year will be how of how many days 366 days the that year is known as the leap year and february has 29 days in that year almost february in february 28 days is there but in leap year when this one for one fourth portion of the day includes and added into other years it completes one day and by adding this day after four year our year will be of how many days 366 days so it is the revolution of the earth it's all about our today's topic and my dear student i we will provide homework and solution in pdf as i told you yesterday so good day and have a nice day